20, just a fraction here. Good preparation, open stance. smile from the coach she covers the court well doesn't she Shontek on the full stretch and the slide into that backhand but Nehemiah equal to the task knew what to cover into the open court Forehand gets the credit for the winner, but it was the serve that set it up from this lady. Yeah, it's certainly a part of her game that has evolved. Look how quickly she gets to that short ball, though. I mean, she has time to spare. Could have gone either way with that. And again, what variety from the German. Who was going to blink first? Good disguise on that forehand, though. She shaped like she was going to hit the big forehand, then at the back swing, just opened up the racket face, dropped it short, and then whipped that one across court. It's a quality finish. He's able to open the court up. Now we talk about the forehand, don't we, the big flat one, but there was a couple of forehands in that point that just showed great variety. The one that doesn't get up all that high and she still manages to brush up the back of the ball and take the pace off it. So she has good variety on that forehand side other than just the big flat one. If you drop it short, it better be perfect. It's almost like, yeah, she changed her mind, didn't she? Way too deep on that attempt to drop shot. I like this reaction from Nima, though, really creating the space. And then after she hits that winner, just getting straight back on task. Again, she was a handful in New York for the world number one. all the time how much court Nehemiah had to cover until eventually it's just too big down her and Oh, that's too good. Break point down. And then drills the backhand up the line for the winner. Second chance to break here. Disappointing end to that point. It's a high quality smash. 
good athleticism to get up and back for this one. She was deep in the court, Shiontek. Let's just have a look at where she was, a contact point. Well judged. Gotta move and give yourself room. Yeah. Sort of full range. Never easy, and Julie Niemeyer is doing her utmost to make it uncomfortable. It's certainly, and uh, Iga Shontek is having to really think her way early in this match, isn't she? We've analysed that the first serve is still not working for her, but it's really putting her under pressure. But she covers the court so well in that game. You heard the the fan response to when Shontek slides out wide. holding back from Nimai here. That was the forehand that created the opportunity to hit the swinging volley. One saved. She blinked in the end, didn't quite get enough on the approach. And the volley was not what she wanted. Iga Sviontek takes a tight opening set after 52 minutes. Oh, she's missed it. And then put in so much good work to stay in the rally. Attack and had the ball to be hit. There was the half volley dig from Niemeyer. Just push that one wide. Look at the reaction from Nimai though. She worked hard for that point. And a bit of pace coming off the first serve. Just 142 Ks way down on the average speed of the first delivery. German does finally get her break right at the start of the second. Fiontek gets herself up and running here in the second. Gee, that's a dangerous return, that one. Unless the drop shot's played perfectly. Taken a foot off the pedal, has she here? Niemeyer knows that she was close in the first and continues just to go after it. Mm. 
almost 50% of the time she was breaking on this surface. And if you look back through the years, it's almost unheard of. Certainly nothing unforced about that. Between unforced and forced, and the Nimai has been going back into that side flat and hard, and you know, that is the shot that can... Anticipation was there, she knew it was going to be short, but you know, she just creates the angle. occasion not quite able to hit the contact she wanted on tech second serve 132 k's just dealt with severely she wants it very well just to make some sort of play on it Again, the depth and the pace oh, of shot oh, from Nimoy. Oh, Guard on the baseline. Just had to react as well as she could to that ball, but could have gone either way. just a little bit caught unawares yeah, the chairman had stopped didn't she mm -hmm. had the ball almost at times to get the ball moving away from Sviontek look at that Great racket head speed. Shontek moved forward as the toss went up on this second serve. Look at that preparation going inside out with the backhand. Yeah. 
Center overcomes a significant test in the Rod Laver Arena. She gets the better of Julie Niemeyer, the German, who threw plenty at the world number one, but ultimately was not enough.